you're, 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 what's going on? It's your boy Philly Fresh, aka the General, here reporting for duty, man. Uh, before I get into this video, man, um, shout out to Harold Carmichael, man. Long overdue, dude should have been in the Hall of Fame. He finally gets there. Um, leads the uh, Eagles and damn near everything. Uh, but from a receiver, touchdowns, um, receiving yards, um. All that completions, all that man, as a receiver, and it's real substantial that this about this video because this is about that. This is about the Eagles as an organization for a very, 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 very long time has not done good when it comes to drafting wide receivers. And I'm gonna and I'm gonna show you how, man. We're gonna get into it right now. Look, Harold Carmichael, right? He was drafted 1971. So you mean to tell me in 30, not because he played 10 years. So in 38 years, nobody could surpass, no receiver could surpass um, him. And in, in, what do you got? Uh, 500 and, uh, 549 receptions, 8,414 yards, 77 touchdowns. Um, and he leaves, he, he leaves the Eagles organization history and all of that. So you mean to tell me in 38 years in a passing league, couldn't nobody do that? Couldn't nobody surpass Harold Carmichael? I'm going to show you why. Since 1971, we went a whole 11 years without having a pro bowl that we drafted, without having a pro bowler wide receiver that we drafted, which was Mike Quick, right? So in 92, we drafted Mike Quick. Another it took a, another eight years to get a pro bowl a pro bowler uh, at the wide receiver position, which was Fred Barnett, and that was in 1990, right? Um, then we drafted Troy Smith in uh, 2000. Uh, I think he only played like dude only played like three games, man. Here's a and here's another thing. Here's a list of um, I want to say a list of uh, players receivers that only played. I only played three years for us, man. Only played three or, or or four years at the most. Four years. We got um, we got Chris T. Jones, Matt Hollins, Reggie Brown, Sheldon Gibson. So you got all these dudes that didn't even that don't even surpass four years. See what I'm saying? So this is one of the reasons why that nobody is surpassing uh, Harold Carmichael, and it, and it's not looking good for the organization, right? So in 2000. Um, you got to, uh, we drafted Todd Pinkston in the second round, no Pro Bowls, right? Um, in 2001, we drafted Freddie Mitchell. Freddie Mitchell, uh, okay, no Pro Bowls, and you know who we uh passed up on? Chad Ocho Cinco, man. We uh, we, he was Chad Johnson then. We surpassed, we 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 didn't take him, we took Freddie Mitchell over there. It's a reason that I'm getting into all this because our evaluation as uh, our evaluation of um, wide receivers is not that good as an organization, man. So something has to change. Hold up, but I'm not done, though. Let's get to it. 2005, we drafted Reggie Brown in the second round. Really? Okay, so from 2000, from 2000 to 2009, the draft is pretty good. That's when we got uh, we got D, uh, DJ, and he has a chance to surpass a lot of these um, things if he can stay healthy. So we got DJ and we got Macklin. Those was 08 and 09. They're good drafts. And a couple years after that, I ain't really gonna it was chip, but it still was the Eagles organization that was making that was making the wrong, that was picking up the wrong, the wrong wide receivers. And we're still doing it to this day. We're still doing it to this day. We picked up J, uh, JJ Arthiga Whiteside instead of instead of getting Metcalf. As an organization, man, we have to do better drafting wide receivers. We're really not we're really not good at it, man. <clears throat> we're really not good at it. Um do you know since Howie has been here, he has never drafted an Alabama player at all, at no position. That has to change. It is a lot, it is a lot of good talent, especially at the wide receiver position from Alabama, from Clemson. He he doesn't draft from these top schools a, as much as he drafts from the lower schools. I don't understand why. The, if the talent is there, you have to grab the talent. Forget this locker room thing. Forget, forget if a dude is a good fit. If he is talented and he can go out there and ball, you got to get him, man. There's it, no rap about that. 
You have to get you have to get the talent because this league is about talent now. It's not about good fits. It's not about good schemes most of the time. Most of the time it's about who can win a one on one matchups. Who is faster? Who is bigger? Who is stronger? So as, as an organization and Howie Roseman, now that you are, are ahead of everybody, it's no more Joe Douglas. So you are taking all the heat about this. Now, when we come into the draft, we got 10 picks. When we come into this draft, we have to make sure that, hands down, we pick talent, not scheme fits. I don't want to hear, oh, this cornerback was a good scheme fit for Jim. Jim. They, get, they let you draft, basically. You get to pick your own players. I don't understand why Doug doesn't get to pick his own players, but Jim Schwartz gets to pick his own players. So all the cornerbacks that we have that we have drafted, this was what Jim Schwartz won. You understand what I'm saying? So we have to do better as an organization in drafting, man. And it starts, it starts with Howie. It starts with Howie. You might have to take the reins from Jim. Because it seems like he doesn't know how he doesn't know how to draft the talent, the talent linebackers. No, we have no talents in linebackers. We have no playmakers on defense. Malcolm Jenkins is a good player, but he is not a playmaker. There's a difference. The dude Adams from um from the New York Jets, he's a safety. He is a playmaker. Michael Jenkins is a good player, man. Not taking nothing from him, man. Getting old up there. Not as fast as he used to be. But he gets the defense where they need to be. But he's not a playmaker. See what I'm saying? Really, our only playmaker on the whole defense is Fletcher Cox. And he didn't have a good year. He had a good he had a good game. Playoff game. He had a great uh, playoff game, but he did not have a good year, man. So we have to evaluate talent better, man. When you send these scouts out and you sitting there and 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 you come to their home or wherever wherever it is, you come to their practices or whatever it is, man, forget about what comes out their mouth. Forget about what they say and look at the talent and evaluate what's going on on that field. Who is the best player that's going to be coming up in the draft, man, with the 21st pick? That's what you got to do, man. I'm tired of I'm tired of hearing I'm tired of not getting this talent, man. I got a long list. I got a long list, man. 48 years of really no talented wide receivers right here, man. No talented wide receivers. Out of 48 years, we got about that we drafted. We got other uh, we got other receivers that made it to the Pro Bowl. I'm talking about that we drafted. Out of 45 years, we got five receivers to the Pro Bowl that we drafted. That is horrible as an organization. Just think about if you would have drafted Chad Johnson and Chad Johnson would have had McNabb. You seen what he did when he when we when he had T.O. for uh, uh, for two years, but you seen what he did when he had him for that four year. We went to the Super Bowl. It's about receivers, man. It's a reason that we didn't win that shit in 2003 because even though T.O., um, even though T.O. was hurt, he didn't have, he, he, he was the only target, for real, for real. I mean, we had Westbrook, but I'm telling you, man, we got to do better when it's coming to drafting these um, these wide receivers, man. If we want to if we want to be better as an organization, if we want to have a gold standard, these are things that we got to do better, draft better, man. But y'all know what it is, man. Stay Philly, stay fresh, y'all. Let me know what y'all think in the comments.